You guys, I don't know if I should. Oh my god, I think it looks weird. I put on eyebrows without cleaning it. Oh my god, why did I do that? I should have left my eye like my brows like that. I'm looking in the camera now. I don't like it. It looks kind of fake, not <laughs> real. So I'm gonna wipe it off. You know, when I get back from work like that, I just want to like sometimes when I'm in a good mood. I want to like look good instead of like passing out on the couch just because you know I don't know if you guys ever feel like that because I've been gone all day and hubby hasn't seen me pretty much all day oh, whatever we're gonna leave it like that anyway good evening welcome back to my channel I want to start by showing you guys this cute outfit I hope this camera will still still <laughs> All right, this cute shirt. I feel like the camera needs to come down more a little bit. Okay, this is not part. This is not part of what I want to show you guys. Okay, so I got this shirt from Shane, <clears throat> and I think I paid twelve dollars for it. I like it a lot. But I feel like in the picture where I got it, like you know, all this model when they model it, they look really nice on them. You know, but for me, I feel like it looks different. It looks a little bit big, but it's already a big, like this is medium. I wear medium size, but the girl was wearing small and it looks big on her. But the way she was rocking it, it's kind of like different. Maybe when I post for picture, it will look more pretty. I don't know, but I feel like it looks big, but he has this. Ah! I feel like that was a person behind me. I thought that was like one of my daughter because they always do that to me they will like creep in and like scare me but yeah this is I don't know what this hand is called palazzo <laughs> I don't know but you can see it's kind of big but it's the style you know I'm not wearing my wet medium but <clears throat> yeah so and I'm wearing my old paint black paint I came home the house is nice and clean because I have to yell at my kid today you guys they don't take me serious and I don't like that because I feel like I play with them a lot so they kind of like don't take me serious so I give them their choice what they should do all of them including the tiny ones so I told them um, what everyone should do and when I caught I usually call them to remind them because sometimes they will say oh I forgot to do it so <clears throat> like around midday I'll call like I'll call in the morning to see what they eat for breakfast i'll call in the midday to remind them of their chores and i'll call like when i'm almost coming home so i call like around two o'clock i told you to to bring out me from the freezer and the freezer was frozen so i said okay take daddy's card since daddy was home today take his card and go get chicken from like a local grocery store because we need to like eat so i told her to give it to my legs to go get it and then so I'll I finish work around five so I'll be I'll get home so I told her to boil the chicken so it will be easier for me I will just cook it and then cook the rice you guys so I caught her oh are you guys the she did he get the chicken has it been boiled and everything like no we haven't got and I would look at the time it was like 4 10 and I finished work like like 15 minutes less than an hour I'm like so when are you gonna go get a chicken boil it so I screamed like I never really screamed like that but sometimes you just so I was like no so I'm gonna come home and start cleaning chicken when you guys are home all you have to do is just get the chicken from a local store right by our house it's literally two minutes by my house and season it and cook it that's all I'm asking for I'm not asking to cook it so when I come home I don't have to be boiling chicken I don't have to stay in the kitchen forever and I have anything to do little things to do on the side so I yelled and screamed on top of my voice like I was so upset that, and that happens all the time. By the time I got home, they just watching, they just washing, washing the meat, and washing the chicken, and then about to cook it. And I would end up like starting and finish. So I said, no, I'm not gonna do that this time. I need to like stand on my feet, stand on my ground, and tell them what to do. So I said, before I come home, I don't know how it wanna get done, but I want it done. And guess what? <laughs> I don't think the chicken was done, but at least they respect me and respect my decision that moment. <sighs> Sometimes you gotta be firm and stand tall 
and speak to them because when you start saying like when are you guys going to do this when are you guys you know that's when you start giving them the privilege like giving them options of what to do so that was really good i'm really proud of myself for doing that i said thank you to them when i go home thank you for doing that thank you for doing this so so that it's not like i'm you know trying to command them or anything but I didn't mean to yell and I let them know that I didn't mean to yell but like I don't want to come home I'm already frustrated about my job already I don't want to come home and start you know cooking all of that but anyway I'm sorry that I had to pour you guys with all of that I'm so sorry but yeah so we're gonna get in the kitchen look at that glow on my face oh my gosh so we're gonna get in the kitchen this hallway is dark and start cooking dinner dinner is gonna be the love fries yeah, I'm going to make jello fries and um, jello fries and salad. Jello fries is my favorite food. Oh my god. Look at my baby skin. It's glowing. It's glowing. It's glowing. Uh -huh. I saw it. I saw it. Like it's so... Oh, <laughs> mashallah. Look, see, I look so cute. These braids A lot of people say Lila look like me. I don't see. Lila look like a father. Like I don't see it. Would yeah, I look like daddy a lot. You, you like you don't have my nose you don't have my leaves you have my eyes a little bit you don't have my eyebrows you don't have the same well you have my hair but i don't know i don't know you think lila looks like daddy come closer to daddy let's see oh daddy's gonna be so happy you always say oh <laughs> okay comment down below if i look like daddy lila um you guys join in the comment section this is gonna look like daddy or me a lot. I know Malika looks What's like this? daddy. What's this? I'll look. What's Go beside this? daddy, let's see. I know Malika mm -hmm. looks like daddy a lot. Malika and daddy looks alike. Mommy, yeah. but what's this mean? That's a lock. I don't know how to work that lock out. Let me no, show you. All, all you have to do is like do this. I need a lock for my work, um, for my locker at work. It's too loud. And I told Hobby to get me a lock. He went and got one of these. And these ones, I don't know how to use it. Like I've tried them before in the no, past. No, 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 no. He, he, and then my husband was like, "Oh, we can figure it out." And he cannot even figure it out himself. Like we try to do everything. Like you guys, how does this work? How does what work? Baby, do you know how to do it? Of course I do. How come you didn't do? I don't come to really open it. It is because I couldn't read the, the um, direction. direction well. That's it. Yeah, but. No, is that how I'm gonna be doing it every time? Turn every left time. and set it. To time, master it and you keep using it. Like with the same way you were reading it. Who taught who to who taught you how to hold the camera, how to do your editing? I don't like it. I just wanna open it and go. I'll just take Nobody you taught just me. Edit it and go? No. Just I figure it out somehow, yeah, but so I learned it, but I'm telling you that I've learned this more than three times and it doesn't work for me. Yeah. You wanna teach me? He said he can show me. So show me how okay. to do it. Go and bring the manual. That manual to inside. Wait, mommy, the which manual? Where is the manual? The tiny paper on my table. Wait. Not the makeup table, the TV table. Okay. <laughs> Mom's right, and he's trying to say, how, how do you learn this? I told you, it's not about that. Sometimes the number is so complicated, if you don't remember the number, you just locked your own lock. And you won't be able to get into your lock. And he's trying to tell me that. Even when he dropped it at work, I was like, I was honest. I don't know how to use these locks. I prefer those ones that you put the key in, you open it, and you're ready to go. This one, you have to memorize the number, and there's a step to it. I don't like it. It's just me, I don't like it. So... We'll see what happens. I'm gonna start on dinner right now. This is the sauce, the uh, broth, rather the broth. I'm gonna use it for jello fries. And this is the chicken right here. That's the chicken right here. And this is oil. So I'm gonna use it to cook jello fries. So let's get cooking. This burner is not working. I don't like it. So, so I have to put my pot here. So. Let's start cooking. And this is not even balancing. Oh. It's cooking tonight. It's better for you. This one is just so perfect, but it's not working. And that's Hobby's music playing in the background. I need some music like Jim Jammy, you know? We'll see how this works. <laughs> Oh, 
this for this one. This part is not gonna work. We're just gonna use this one because it's smaller. So we're gonna use it. the fresh green kale and red spinach this one right here that's really good Mom, did and you I know the reason why it's actually red it's because it's been through red waters yeah i put some maple syrup 100 percent maple syrup oh it's not, just, oh, it's not covering anymore it's almost done though so and what else any garlic what's the garlic Lila? come on come on assistant this one. This garlic? Yes. And I need Dijon. Dijon mustard. So I always put that much garlic in there. And I need Dijon. And it's a big squeeze of Dijon in here. Tell me when it's that, okay? Yeah. And we need apple cider. Keep going. That's good. And I need apple cider and just gonna put a little bit not too much because it's yeah. gonna make it sour yeah it's really healthy for you when you do it like that and then like, you want to cover this and then this is a uh, dressing mommy can you take my tea you want to mix it like a mix yeah and why i am going to be chopping some kale salad i already washed my kale no, you tell them when you got the knives from. I think we need tongs, but yeah. you can use one if you want. You want tongs? Yeah. Uh oh. It's a very delicious salad. Yeah, this salad, it tastes really good. The first yeah. time I've ever tried it, it was delicious. Yeah. And I'm gonna do some carrots. I'm gonna grate some carrots on it. Oh. And go. No, no. Who wants to sprinkle it? Me. Okay, I take half and you take half. Okay. Here, take, take some. Of it. Take some of it. That's <laughs> hot. I really like it. Mommy, guess what we had for lunch? Oh. Mm -hmm. On Friday. Mom, that's what we have for lunch on Friday. Are they here? Mm -hmm. Wow. We have tuna. I mean, like, um, I mean, we have, like, um, salmon. Mm -hmm. Um, with pasta. pasta. Together. Mm -hmm. And let me not eat it. I finish it all. I did not enjoy. And there was even, and there was even people. And I eat it all. Yeah? Well, I'm excited for Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like tuna pasta. No, sorry. I, I shouldn't say I like tuna pasta. Well, 
I like it to some extent. I like it when I make it because there's some stuff that I like in my tuna pasta. So I don't know how your day can made it, but. No, no, we only added pasta and tuna and a little bit of seasoning. And I'm, oh. yeah, because your school, they try to give vegan, like healthy food. Your daycare, it's healthy food. Yeah, everything. Everything is healthy food. Even burger buns, even the cinnamon cookies. Yeah. Which I think it's okay for them to do that. It's just that not every kid like healthy food. It doesn't taste delicious, but it's good for them. Why are you always doing that? Coming in here to hide. Are you not supposed to be keeping my yacht? You're hiding. You're I've supposed been to. All day. Yeah. Have you have you been spending time with me? My back hurts. Have you been spending time with me? You heard what I just said. My have you spent time hurts. with me all day today? You're cooking. Exactly. That's when you're supposed to be spending I time. Pepper. I didn't know where you get it from. It's just shocking. I know. <laughs> the peppers are so strong. Nice. I I brought it from from work. So it's too just too hot. There's a scotch pepper that I got. And I could see you are making some recording. I'm coughing, so I know. I don't want people to be saying it's coughing. Mm. It's going to dry. I know. So I don't even want to wipe my tripod. Yeah. That's why I came inside. That's not why you come inside. You always come in here to hide. Possibly I always do, but that was my reason today. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm just waiting for the rice to cook. And I can cuddle with this man right here. Cook, 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 cook rice. Kilo Rice. Rice? Like white rice and stew? You enjoy me? I thought they from breakfast then, but I think it's no breakfast then. They had rice for breakfast? I think that is what they No, they, they had cereal. Okay. The way my kids eat rice in this house is crazy. We eat we eat lots of rice. Like, we eat a lot of foods, but like rice is like our main thing. Do you guys ever feel like that? I know some people don't eat rice a lot. A lot of people eat salads. But yeah, we do eat salads too, but rice is like the main but food. But I eat... Fruits a lot. Yeah, That's my husband thing. eats fruits a lot. I feel like daddy and the little kids eat lots of fruits, which is great. Yeah. I'm just waiting for my jollof fries to be ready. You guys, my lips are getting pinker and pinker. Are you okay? I notice lips. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. The best cosmetic uh, thing, lip balm or lip okay. something. Yeah, I like it. And I didn't even apply any today. Mm. Yeah. Okay, you guys. My jollof rice is ready. And it tastes so good. It tastes so delicious. This is it. I want to get a spoon and mix it and show you guys. I hope this is not frozen. Sorry. So, yeah. This is it, you guys. Ooh. I have this Caribbean friend, Howard, that loves our food. Okay, if you're Caribbean or Jamaican or um, African American, if you like Nigerian jollof fries, leave me a comment in the comment section. I want to hear it. I have this girl that go crazy for Nigerian jollof fries at work, and she's not working tomorrow or next tomorrow. But on Wednesday, I'm gonna be taking some to her. Like she will love it. She will go crazy for it. Let me know if you're Jamaican or Caribbean or African American if you like jollof rice from Nigeria. And I think Nigerian jollof rice is the best compared to, sorry honey, compared to Ghanaian. We always, always have that argument. Nigerian and, and Ghanaian jollof rice. Do you love mommy jollof rice? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
or Gen X. Gen Z, yeah, only Gen Z or Gen X. What does that mean? That means you're born in the 2000s. I mean, like a bit, actually. Yeah, you don't feel old. You mm -hmm. don't feel like exactly. And literally, Gen Z, not with their rings. Imagine if I was in the Yeah, I feel old. Mm -hmm. I feel really old. Mommy.